Hello friend, uh, I hope you are doing well. Uh, so finally we have managed to complete your project requirement. So the idea of the project was that uh, a user uh, should be able to connect his SD card with ESP32 and should be able to navigate between the files. Okay. So you have sent me a link in which uh, the user was doing the same thing, but instead of using SD card, it was using the Swiss memory of the ESP32, right? So I have changed, make some changes to the code. So now we could access the files from the SD card. Okay. So there are two main files. Uh, one is your main file main.cpp and the other one is this web server dot two dot h. So I have made the changes on this part. So I will deliver you these two files. You just have to copy this main.cpp file in your Arduino ID and just copy this web server dot two dot h in the same directory of the folder. Okay. So imagine if like I have this uh, this folder okay src folder so you should have the uh, ino file uh, and the web server file in the same folder that's it you have to do okay the next change you have to do is to change the ssid and the password uh, for your of course access point another thing is like the sd card pins that you are using in my case i am using miso for 2 mosi for 15 SCLK for 14 and chip select for 13. Okay, this you have to configure your uh, pins according to your uh, according to your SPI pins you are connected with you are connecting with the ESP.2. Okay, so let's start with the demo. Okay, I have connected my ESP32. I will make a restart to the serial monitor. Okay, it's trying to connect with the Wi-Fi. Okay, it's connected. So the first information I got is like my SD card is connected. It has like 1.86 GB of total memory, out of which we are using 336 KB, okay? And similarly, the other information that I got from the access point. So this is my IP address that I got. So what I will do, I will bring this one. And make a refresh okay that's it <coughs> okay so first i will see okay that's fine exactly this is my storage file so i will list files very fine so i have internal view png one file and this is another file okay what i will do i will try to upload some files uh, let's say i will upload external view this file Okay, you can see we have this file and I will try to upload again some other files. Mm, maybe this one or this one. Let's try this one. Okay, done. Let's try some other format files. Let's say I will upload my CV. Yeah, that one is also uploaded. So what I will do, okay, so even we could just for the test, let me delete this file. Okay, it's deleting this file, that's fine. Now what I will do, I will take out the my SD card and put in directly to my computer to see if I got these files in the folder or not, okay. So I'm turning off my device, taking out my SD card and I'm trying to put it with my SD card reader. Let's see. Okay, very fine. Okay, that was my CV. Yeah, that's exactly what I uploaded. Yeah, that's something I was uploaded. Yeah, that's fine. Then I have this photo. Yeah, it's this is the one I exactly uploaded. And this one. That's very, very fine and also yeah this is this is this one is working actually okay so this was it uh, i will upload uh, these two source files uh, to you i hope you like the work let me know if you have any questions thank you